Um. Ooh. Oh, just out of range. Nice. I feel like he's not going to prioritize my infantry unit to shoot. He'll probably go for one of the others. One of the actual tanks. So I think we're still doing good. For the moment. Looks like I need to get serious. Aw oh, crap, he's increasing the range. I'm pretty sure that increases the range. Wow. Prioritizing that over everything that's over there. Okay, he can do that. Hey. Didn't get the kill. What? No! I was sure there wouldn't be any more anti-air over there. It's over there in the top right corner, I bet. Alright, I have my power up, but nothing is really within range to shoot. Oh, not a trap! Woo! At this point, I'm on a scouting mission with this thing. Alright, those are clear. Would he have anti-air around his base? Probably, but maybe not. If he does, I can plop this over there. And kind of see. If he doesn't hit this with anti-air missile, he probably doesn't have anti-air near his base. this shoot up? I don't even know. Land and sea. No. Cannot. Fired anything? Nothing can really fire at anything here. Hey, is he within range of the castle? Yes, he is, so I need to kill that. The helicopter should be able to. And if the helicopter dies, this can. Not the, yeah, the helicopter. I see no reason not to at this point. And the recon is just going to be bait at this point. Oh yeah, range units don't fire back. That sucks. Alright, that's okay. No, nothing's firing at it. No, oh, first. You know what? CO power. Max force.
Capture! I read 95%. I think I can kill it. I don't even feel like I'm doing a particularly good job here. I mean, I am using some tactics, so that's good. It's another one of those situations where... I feel like I don't really need the tactics, just like the last one. I just kind of brute force the crap out of him. Okay, that'll start being effective eventually. Wow, that did a lot more damage than I thought it would. Alright. End! Oh no! Yeah, I should've known. Not down there. Where the heck is it? He's in here, isn't he? Yep. But funny enough, he can't actually defend the main base. Because he can't shoot right next to him. See up there, so I can shoot that. That's nah, not very effective. It'll get up there eventually. Ugh. Really? That's your attack range? That is pathetic. I actually forgot infantry can just go straight over the mountains. Okay, let's put you there. Put you there. You guys will be able to attack next turn. Let's bring you over here where you might be able to attack if they don't kill you. thing out. And you should be able to actually kill it. With ease. there? No? Or of them just kind of vanished. Weird, okay. 
I did have to leave that there, didn't I? I could have taken that out this turn. Oh well. I should end this turn either way. Or are those just the only two units left? What? There's definitely units in the upper right. Which means I'm going to want to capture the base instead of hunting down all the units. operative term there. I'm not saying there isn't. But there shouldn't be. Really? That's his vision range? He's gonna die now, isn't he? No, nothing over there. Alright. Should be doing okay. Yeah, he's just plain dead. Nothing else really matters. There we go! Captor! That was, again, long and sloppy. Howdy, Max. Long time no see. Grit? Is that you? I was wondering why I hadn't seen you around lately, and now I know. You're working for Blue Moon, you traitorous piece of gar... Aw, Maxie, don't be like that. I got my reasons for doing what I do, you know? Man, I'm getting out of here before you be started preaching again. See y'all down the road. Hold it, Grit! Dang, he got away. But what's he doing with Blue Moon? Chalk another one up for me! Still an A rank somehow. Jade Rat. Blast! We're running out of opportunities. I don't see the need to get so worked up. It's not like this is Blue Moon property to begin with. What did you say? After all my work and planning? It's common theft, man. Nothing more, nothing less. Why, you insolent little... Whoa, hold on, Chief. Don't you think it's time to move out? Like you said, the Orange Star troops are knocking on our door. Grit, you're pushing your luck. Don't go anywhere, you understand? I'll deal with you when I get back. Let's take it to him! Here we go! Hello, Andy, Max, can you hear me? What is it, Nell? I've learned that this is a vital deployment for our point for Olaf. If we can drive him from the region, we may just cripple his army. Really? This may be where we can end the conflict with Olaf. That's right. We just need to capture as much property as possible, and fast. The first army to secure 12 properties will win this battle. Stay alert, and good luck. Let's see. Yep, we've got, a we've got bases for deploying troops, and... Okay, understood. Let's go. Alrighty then. Got some super obvious ones here. Blue one's on the other side. We got an MD tank just sitting right frickin' there. Load him up and 
get him a-going. You move out. How much money do I have? 3,000? Mech seems like a good idea. Good-ish idea. You go for defense. Uh, nothing should be coming from this way, actually. Too many trees. I'll probably come from this way. I can dart back if I need to. Day one. I totally deployed that unit the wrong way. <coughs> Day two. How much damage can you do? 94. Will that kill it? Does it round up? I don't know. I think it might. No, it doesn't round up. That sucks. Oh, I couldn't avoid this any other way. Okay, that's fine then. Can you continue to capture? This way. And I think I will not build anything this turn. I think I want to not do that. Oh, just once around my defenses. That was what I didn't want to happen. Alright. Mm, I could save up for an ND tank. But I think I will take more infantry. You should be able to do some damage to him. And then start capturing. Hmm. Choices. I think I would rather kill this. There's a good chance the MV tank will try to take out the mech instead of anything else. Which will give me the opportunity to do to destroy it with the MV tank next turn. I think that's what'll happen. If it doesn't happen, I may have just screwed myself over. He just made a recon unit, and he's a dumbass. I don't know why you would ever make a recon unit in a non-fog of war situation. Well, I guess if you're sniping infantry, they're pretty fast infantry snipers. And he did exactly what I thought he would. There we go! Did 
he do any damage at all? No, he can't. In fact, you will come heal over here. You will start the capture. You will move in. You will come up here. Drop you there. Probably didn't really need you to, but you will move out anyway. Now I should be able to afford something nice, no? I will not be defeated! Is it first to own 12 lands, or the first to actually capture 12 lands? Or towns, or whatever it is. Where the heck is that thing going? Okay. Just come down here and shoot it. Not particularly useful. bring you over and drop you there so that you can heal a little bit closer to the action. You will start slowly trudging away this way. I'd be to bring him over here. Can anything reach that? No. There's too many trees in the way. Ah, oh, now he's gonna. Now this one I have a choice. Make sure there's a way to status. He has eleven bases. If he captures one more, I lose. I think. So I'm about to lose. Oh shit. Can I stop him? I think that's what that means. It said first to 12 bases. I don't know why I. S that's on my side, so. No matter how I look at it, this is probably very bad for me. Um... Right, so there's 11 bases just on his side? How many are over here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. See, there's 11 on his side and 10 on mine? That is so unfair! I could have made like a recon unit earlier. That was probably my big mistake. I was trying to save up for an MD tank. I don't need an MD tank to take out infantry. A recon unit would have been fine to block this stupid bridge. Now because of that, I'm gonna lose this whole thing. I think, if I understand the rules properly. You need to look closely to the location of the bases and cities. There are 11 properties on each side of the river, dividing the map. So as long as you hold on to the ones on this side, you can't lose. First, concentrate on getting rid of the infantry and mech units over here. After that, you can build up some firepower and cross the river. Yeah, I just lost. Damn it! Well, it is what it is. That's how it goes when you YOLO. I always liked Advance Wars. I don't play it very much. 
But I always found it always really fun and interesting. It's not one of those series many people talk about, except for those who want to be like, hey, here's a Nintendo game that nobody really knows anymore, that nobody ever cared about. And that is it for me on Advance Wars. At least Advance Wars 1. And yeah, that's it for the first Advance Wars. I will see you in the next video. Later!